Hello everybody, I like very much all typewriters and calculators. I have a quite big collection of these. I am showing these typewriters and calculators in this channel. I also have a cat. It's a nice cat. My wife loves him. The problem is he don't care about all typewriters. I will prove it to you in these videos. At the end of this series of videos, you will agree with me. My cat don't like typewriters. Today's agenda is 1. My cat don't care altmometer. 2. My cat don't care folio 7. 3. My cat don't care Hammond multiplex. 4. My cat don't care Blickensderfer. 5. General considerations about my cat. This is a very old arithmometer from 1897. It is a wonderful mechanical calculator. You can do additions, multiplication, subtraction and divisions. I was sure he would appreciate it, but he don't care. Would you believe it? My wife is very patient with him and try to show him this calculator. I really don't understand my cat. This is still my cat. You can see my wife try to get him interested in the typewriter, but he doesn't. It's a Folio 7 from 1924. You see, it's very particular. I think you are interested, but you see, my cat doesn't care. My wife try to explain him how it works. It doesn't have the keyboard but a pointer and you choose the letters on a plate. And there aren't the levers with the characters but the tie wheel with letters. It's fantastic, but you see, the cat doesn't care. I would like very much it like typewriters. We could go to the typewriter exposition together. It could help me in cleaning typewriters, but my cat absolutely don't care about it. This is an old typewriter Hammond Multiplex from 1913. It has a very unique printing mechanism and a particular system of storage of the sheet of paper under the carriage. There is already the video in my channel and uh, I'm trying to explain this to my cat. He's there looking at the typewriter but it's clear he don't care about it. You see, the typewriter can carry two fonts at the same time and you can change the one from the other in a few seconds. Also there is a special charging mechanism so that uh, the typing characters hit always the paper with the same force. The typing characters are selected with an ingenious mechanism with pins inside the turret with a moving wheel. It's uh, really simple if you see it, but my cat doesn't even try to understand this. This is an old Blickensderfer 7 from 1910, more than one century old. My wife tried to explain him that this typewriter has a character typing ball and not the typing bars, but my cat doesn't even want to look at it. My wife tried to show him the typewriter, but he only is interested when he thinks she wants to pet him. He doesn't care about it. I think he should think a little more about his culture. It was light and easy to carry. At those time, the typewriters were very heavy and difficult to carry, and this was a novelty. You could easily carry this typewriter on a train with you, and also work with it. It was a big revolution. Imagine the work of reporters. And you could take this typewriter at home. Telework was possible also 100 years ago. But you see, my cat uh, seems he don't care about this big discovery in human history. But of course, when my wife uh, pet him, he is very interested. Mm -hmm. 
You have seen the proofs. My cat don't like typewriters. He only cares about sleeping in my bed. Being combed by my wife. He could last hours being combed on the table. And being petted. The only keyboard he likes is the one on my laptop when I'm working on it. I don't understand why he hates the typewriters and loves my laptop when I'm working on it. It doesn't make any sense. If you want to see the, these uh, typewriters without my lazy cat, you can see these in this channel. I would like to show my cat doing interesting and funny things, like in all other YouTube videos, but I can't. Hope to do in next video. I apologize for my cat behaving like this. I'm very sorry. I don't know what to do. If anyone experienced the same problem and had resolved it, can you please tell me what can I do?